Hi, this is my hot water um, system. This is the switchboard. Uh -huh. This is a switchboard. And I want to show you today uh, this Nextion HMI that I installed next to the Raspberry Pi. Okay, uh, here you, you can see the Raspberry Pi, and this is the, the Nextion uh, HMI. This is a touch screen which shows uh, real time information about the status of the hot water system, uh, solar, solar panel temperature, uh, accumulated hot water temperature, the pump, if the pump is running or not, uh, etc. You know, you, here you have all that information in real time. Here you can see uh, how often the information is, is, uh, is updated. Um, all the information comes from MQTT. And as you can see, uh, the HMI is uh, sourced from the data that comes from the Raspberry Pi. As I said, uh, all the switchboard is controlled by that Raspberry Pi. And then let me touch, for example, that manual thing that I have here, which is a uh, part which allows me to put system in a manual mode. And then I can start uh, switching some parts manually. For example, uh, if I want to start the pump, start the, oops. Uh, yeah, now the pump is running. Okay, if I go back to the status display, I can see. Uh, oops, let me come back here. Let me start. Okay, now pump is running and everything is running in manual mode so the it's not the computer who is who, who is taking uh, the actions automatically it was what I click in the screen then let me stop the pump let me pass again to the automatic mode <laughs> and this is this is the idea what I want to show you with you today that uh, HMI only costs about twelve dollars, twelve euros to be more precise. <laughs> okay, it's not so expensive, and it took me about about a day more or less since I didn't know anything about how to play with Nextion and create uh, that HMI for uh, monitoring and for uh, controlling my uh, hot water switch uh, panel so I recommend I strongly recommend you to take a look about those Nextion uh, devices and uh, Nextion HMIs to be more precise okay guys thank you very much